Okay, yeah, so before the video starts, sorry if I do have to make this quick interruption, but I would like to say before the video starts that you can now become a member on my channel. So basically, if you guys don't know how to become a member, basically you just have to go to my channel page and click the join button. And also put your payment information uh, via credit card or PayPal or whatever you use. So yeah. If you guys are on mobile, by the way, you can't see the join button, then uh, there will be a link in the description if you guys do want to go buy it. And then, yeah, also thank you, Rank50, for being one of the first members on the channel. It's very much appreciated. And your name will be at the end of the middle, f at the end of the video for a free channel. Sorry for the, for the, like, misconceptions there. Alright, so now, back to the video, guys. Yo, what is going on, you guys? It is Master Nicholas. Want to do one here? Welcome back to another video today. Now, in this video, guys, I'm gonna be showing you how you can actually reduce game lag and speed up gameplay in this video. So here, so here, I'm gonna show you some tips of how to do exactly that. Now, let's get into the video. So, if you're in a game like Arsenal, what you're gonna do is that you're gonna press this Roblox icon thing, or whatever and go to settings and then click on automatic and then it'll show it should say manual and then turn this all the way down just to reduce it and yeah that should clear up the first tip now on to tip two which is lowering the resolution now i have a 1600 by 900 monitor for my main one and my other monitor is a 1280 by 1024 so that does take a pretty decent amount of resources, so if you want to lower the resolution speed of gameplay, what you're going to do is that click on this Windows icon, and then go to Settings, go to Settings here, and then wait for this to load, then go to System, go to System, alright. If you have dual monitors like me, select the one that you mainly game on, or like what you're using, and Here's the recommended resolution, just to make it like more clean. But if you want like smaller resolution, just to speed up gameplay, you're gonna select the one that is suitable for you. So if you want like the highest FPS, you can go to like 1280 by 720p. Now it's gonna black out your screen just for a second, and then it should say keep these display settings, and then keep changes. And you can also do this with your other monitor. And put it like maybe at like 1024 by 768 maybe, and then yeah, you can probably do that I guess. So yeah, that is tip number two. Okay guys, so for tip number three is to remove textures. Now basically, you're just gonna, if you're on this page, just click the minimize button. And then go to the Ro where it says Roblox where it should show this. Right click right click and then go to go to open a file location now here is where you're going to select platform content double click that pc and then textures and now here's all the textures that you're going to see right here and yeah so if you want you can like see like medium icons just to see like what textures you want to get rid of. So basically you're just gonna like right click this um new folder. So if in case you, if in case you guys want to keep the textures you can leave them in a separate folder. So just move all the textures you don't want in the folder. And yeah I'm gonna speed up this process just to make it go faster and yeah. So when that's done, you're just gonna like click X on that, and then if you want to place the folder somewhere, you can you can place it in downloads if you guys do want. You guys place it in downloads. I promise it will be there once. Um, yeah, it would be like around right here, your new folder. I mean, if you do want to rename it, yeah, whatever. And you like Roblox te textures, you can rename it to that. Then, yep, there you go. Mm -hmm. you, you just press yes if this shows up. And yeah, that is 
for tip number three. Okay, so for tip number four. So basically here you just want to install a third-party Roblox FPS on the locker. So what you're going to do now is that you, you can go to the search bar type in Roblox FPS on locker on Google 2020. Now the version I have here is that, okay, yeah, click on this. And then I recommend that using this version since this one right here isn't really working for me. So here you can open it in a new tab. And then uh, depending on your like system or whatever, you can download the 64 bit or if you have a 32 bit computer, you can download it right here. So you can download this right here. Since I already do have it downloaded. I do I already do have it downloaded, so yeah, we're just gonna download it again anyways, just because, um... So, here is when you want to double click on this. Click on that. And then... And then, it'll show up with this. New version of FPS and Logger is available. It is available. Just hit no on that. Just because, like, for me it's not working. It might work for you guys, I really don't know. And then, right here, in... In the bottom right corner, you'll see a Roblox FPS and locker. So right click that, and then here's the FPS cap. You can cap it to 30 if you want, you can cap it to 60, 75, 120, 144, or even 240 FPS. But the recommended is um, none right here. So let's try to hop into an Arsenal game and see if this will like affect the gameplay. So once you guys have done all the tips, this is going to a random game for example, I just chose Arsenal for example. Now, if you want to check your FPS, just press Shift F5 at the same time. Shift F5, and then, hold on, let me click on it, Shift F5, and then, since I am recording, is that maybe 100, 100 FPS maybe? With the textures I'll remove. Now, just for the sake of the video, I'm just gonna cap it at like maybe 75, just because like I don't want the recording to lag. Now let's actually test it in a real game. Alright, so we're just gonna deploy here. And um, yeah, it seems pretty cool. Yeah, with all the textures, it does seem kind of smooth. And you can actually play better after. So yeah. And yeah. I don't like that. Uh, okay. Alright, yeah. And I guess we can test another game, like, um... I guess we could test another game, I guess. With the exact same tips. I promise the FPS won't really, like, drop as much with... It depends what game you're playing, basically, and, um... I guess you can test it from there. Yeah, I just like that guy. That's so funny, ha ha ha. So we're just in the game called Jailbreak. Now let's see the FPS on this. Now I know the new lighting update is going to come, so I'm pretty sure this is going to have a lot. Yeah, the textures are all gone just because, yeah, these have the textures and all. Except for the ground, yeah, I don't know why that's still there, but so. it's just the textures you want to move. And I'm pretty sure the animation from these are gone just because you moved the animation a little bit. So um, yeah, we're just going to push Shift F5 and yeah, look at the FPS. I'm gonna like uncap it and then yeah, look, voila, look at a hundred, hundred, uh, fifteen FPS. If you're on an HP player video like me, which um really isn't the best computer, but it's good for gaming at least. It on like the lower graphics maybe. So yeah, thumbs up if you have like potato computer. I don't know, but yeah, let's try to play some jailbreak with these new tips. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna escape through prison. These views have textures, but really not anymore. And yeah, let's um, I celebrate. So yeah, let's escape through here and yeah, let's spawn a vehicle and then and yeah, just chug this car just for the heck of it. And yeah, <laughs> we're just driving around the city, just because like yay. And look at the water. 
Yeah, it looks pretty much clear just because like I, I uh, removed the animation, and that's just a blank color, also. And if you want, you could turn off the graphics, but I wouldn't really recommend this because it does. If you have like a bad computer, kind of like me, then it would lag, so I wouldn't really recommend this. But yeah, I'm getting probably like 24 FPS just because I'm like and stuff like that. So it's like I'm not even going down. And I didn't nearly cross the record. <laughs> yeah, okay, so yeah. I hope that you guys find this video helpful. If you guys are new here, then make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on those notifications so you know what the future videos go live. And yeah. Also, if you guys want to talk to me on Discord and stuff like that, then um, it's in the description below if you guys do want to join it. And yeah, I'll see you guys next video. Live stream. And yeah, this is.